welcome to this main library tour 2021. So in this tour, we're going to show you some of the cool things you can do in the main library on the Dundee University City Centre campus. So first, getting into the library. So here's my colleague Ian. Hi, everybody. And we're going to show you how you get into the library. So here's my wonderful colleague Ian here showing us to make sure you put on your face mask before you get in the library. You might also want to use the sanitation stations and also get your student card or you can get a barcode on the University of Dundee app as well you can use. So you can see here Ian just placing his card on the yellow card placeholder and that lets you in. So you can see here, tap your card, gates open and you have made it into the library. So the next thing we're going to look at is the info zone. So this is where you can go and speak to a lovely member of the library team. Again, you can see Ian sitting here, welcoming you to the library. So what other things will you find on the ground floor? So you'll find lots of direction markers showing you which way to go into and out of rooms in the library. On the left hand side here is the cafe. Um, when this reopens, it'll be set up a little bit differently, but you'll be able to get beverages, etc. On the right side here, we have the academic skill zone. So the academic skills team uh, sometimes holds sessions there. So continuing on the right side of the corridor, uh, you can see on the right hand side some self-issue machines so you can check out books to yourself. And straight ahead there at the end is our leisure reading collection, but we're going to turn into GB1 here and you'll see here our lovely group study areas. So various computers and study desks. Only sit at desks with a green tick. This keeps everyone at a safe social distance. Printing facilities, lockers, and those self-issue machines. And you can also pick up requests and return book items here as well. Uh, one of our exciting features on the ground floor is the create space. Um, but you can see here 3D printers, sewing machines, badge makers, all sorts of glue, lots of things you can use there. We also have group study spaces here. So spaces where you can speak and collaborate with people. You can also visit all the different continents of the world, as you can see Ian contemplating there. Um, and these rooms uh, will be bookable if you check out our library website for more information. We're going to go up to level one now, up the stairs. Make sure you go up the right staircase, very important. And also that you sanitise your hands. Very important in the modern climate, make sure and do that. We also have some material that allows you to sanitise any desk you sit at. So just come out there, get a wipe and just start cleaning away. I wouldn't advise that you let Ian do this because why am I talking about myself in the third person? <laughs> I'm not very good at it. So throw that away. Uh, some group study space here on the balcony to the atrium and some printing equipment as well. It's quite tiring working, so take a break from time to time. <laughs> We've heard those sofas are very comfy, uh, on good authority from some students. <laughs> and some staff. Uh, okay, so we're going to go through into the area, which is a quiet study zone, so whispering only. You'll be delighted to see there's books here. Books, books, books. <laughs> oh, and also a hot water tap, very handy if you want a hot drink in the winter. So let's go in. What's Ian going to show us next? Well, we saw the lockers there. We're going to take, as I pull my treasures up, <laughs> we move around to the left and see the Taybridge studio. So anyone who wants to make a video or the like can use this area here. We've got a green screen, microphone, all kinds of equipment that you can use to make videos. We have, of course, got study space here. And as you look ahead, you'll see a forest of information. Ooh, I like that. Uh, also, next to these trees, you will see the uh, corresponding shelf marks for the books which are housed in that bay. Ian's going to show us here. It corresponds to the sticker on the side of a book. So uh, you'll get that number from library search when you are looking for a book. You can also browse books of similar topic. Put it back on a shelf. Library staff love that. <laughs> oh, Ian, like Willy Wonka, is going to show us the Strawberry Bank. Uh, Ideas Lab here. So this is a great space for collaborative work. It's often used for classes, um, but can be booked by other groups. And here are some other group rooms as well you can book on level one. Let's go up a level. Let's go to level two. <gasps> Let's follow Ian. Again, make sure you're going up the right staircase. One staircase is for up, one staircase is for down. And I know the view at this window is often people's favourite. Lovely views. We find ourselves on 2A, 
Which is a bit confusing because it looks exactly like 1A. It certainly confused me. But don't worry, it's just more study space and PCs you can use. And printers. Let's go into 2B. So what do we have waiting for us through these double doors? We do have a silent study space. Yeah, very popular around exam time. What a surprise. <laughs> Great for getting your head down and not being interrupted. Our book stock also runs up, uh, so if you can't find the number, it might be up there. We also have some educational resources. And there's the law library, just in case you weren't sure what that was saying, I pointed to it. <laughs> it's also silent study for all those hardworking law students. Uh, lots of study desks here, computers, and specialist law resources as well. Specific material, law reports. You've got to love them. You're bound to love them. Why wouldn't you? I like them when I'm not a lawyer. We have a great collection, loads of stuff here. You might not even be able to find some of those online. Uh, lighting is motion sensitive. The big man can't run that fast. It's speeded up. Don't do this at home, kids. <laughs> uh, so when you're finished in the library um, and you're allowed to escape, we don't keep you here. Um, make sure you're using the down staircase. So this is the correct staircase. And what things might you want to think about before you leave, Ian? Oh, you need to make sure you've got all your possessions. Make sure you've got your, your laptop or your device. You might want to think if you've got any books you want to borrow, make sure and borrow them before you leave. You might also want to make sure you're, at this point you get your card or your barcode on the app ready because you'll need that to get out. Definitely. You don't want to cause any bottlenecks. You have practice going in, so it should be easy. So we're going to go out. Hopefully it'll also be a beautiful sunny day when you leave the library. Because you are in Sunday. It's <laughs> fabulous. We so look forward to meeting you. Look forward to seeing you soon. And please follow us on our social media accounts for library updates.